Hey, I'm Kip Johnson. Nice to meet you. Please let me into your school. Hi, my name is Dr. Bonacorsi. I'm going to spend the next hour looking for any reason not to let you in. Thank you, thank you. That sounds great. Oh, of course, anytime. So let's get right into it then. Why do you want to be a doctor? Yeah, you know, I was born to be a doctor. My mother and father, they really wanted me to be a doctor. So at a young age, at the age of zero, right when I came out of the womb, I put on my diapers, tightened up those huggies real nice, and got to work in that hospital right away. So I was born for this, and I am now ready to become a doctor starting at this medical school. Oh, I'm not paying attention. I'm just thinking about all the research I'm missing out on by being here right now. All right, so let's just keep this moving. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Yeah, you know, I uh, love playing the violin. I love the piano. I love all sorts of music, sports. I love medicine. Um, yeah, I basically have no idea what's going on in my life right now. Please let me in so I have meaning. So, okay, another generic answer with an emotional breakdown. Okay. Well, let's go to some specifics on your application. Get this, get this interview really going, okay? Oh, I'm ready. Oh, okay. So I have your file here. We're just gonna be going through it, okay? Perfect. All right. Okay, let's see what we have here. Kip Johnson. Here's a shot of your profile. Some good experiences, some really good stats down here. Thank you, thank you. Excellent. So let's just go into some of these experiences you have. Um, tell me about this honor society that you're in. Uh, it seems to be very prestigious. The honor society? Yeah, of course I can tell you so much about it. You know, it was a great society where you can distinguish yourself from your other applicants through the low premium price of $100. I particularly enjoyed the free t-shirt and coffee mug. You're so full of shit. I smelled it before I even walked in here. Well, let's just keep this interview moving along here, uh, Kip. Kipper, Lil' Kip. Kip is fine. Dr. Bonacorsi. So I do see you have a pretty impressive research paper here on your resume. Thank you so much. I worked so hard on that during my undergrad years and I'd love to discuss the paper with you. Right, no, that's great. Uh, why don't you go ahead and tell me about the totally irrelevant study on how Trix yogurt helped college kids feel statistically significantly less prepared for standardized exams. Irrelevant, sir. We found that Trix yogurt helped college kids feel statistically significantly less prepared for their standardized exams than those who did not consume the Trix yogurt. All flavors were tested. Okay, Kip, let's keep it moving. If you were going to be any part of a bicycle, what part would you be? Seriously? This is a medical school interview, not dick sporting goods, sir. I understand how you feel, but medical schools like to ask these meaningless questions to try to dive into your inner thoughts and get into that subconscious to really see what you're thinking. Hmm. All right. Well, in that case, I'm a Sikh because I feel like I'm being shit on during this interview. So, Kip, do you have any questions to conclude this interview? Am I in? Probably not. I really didn't like you. You need a haircut and you're kind of full of it. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure. Oh, it was a of pleasure. course, of course. Anytime. All right. You have a good day now. Kip. Kip yeah, Skip. Skipper. Lil Skipper. Goodbye. You're not in. All right, guys, that's it for the video. Thank you for watching. I know we tried something new this time. I hope you liked it. If you want to see more skits like this, just let us know. And until next time, make sure for those of you who are new to subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Subscribe to Kip Johnson, everybody. Kip Johnson, he's a legend. <laughs>